Texas in 1989 cared about Newtonian physics. But the only Newtons they cared about were Wayne and Fig. That's my sister. And for the nourishment of our bodies and bless the hands that prepared it. Amen. How come we ain't got no tater tots? I made tater tots last night. I've got tater tots over my potatoes any day. Just eat what I made you. Can we at least have... No, Mary, can't meet after church. Georgie? I got something in my playbook. I'll go with you, Mom. Why are you going? You don't believe in God. No, nope. but I believe. In Matthew 9, verse 4, Jesus said, Why would you entertain evil thoughts in your heart? You have evil thoughts? I just don't think this part applies to me. That's fine. Be quiet and listen. And for the record, they descended when I was 15. Oh, Matilda Spark. I heard you're going to high school tomorrow. I am. You're going to have to find someone else to torment on the playground. Torment? I need some more to see her ass. Her ass? <laughs> That's funny. I'm going to sleep. She's lying. She just said that to make you feel better. Mom doesn't lie. Sure, she thinks the earth was made in six days, but that's because she's gullible, not a liar. Professor Paul Todd wears a bow tie! George Jr.? Give me back that bow tie right now. I didn't take Don't it. Don't you lie to me. I'm not lying! Don't see about that. Stay out of my room! She's gonna go. Would you like to play a driving game? Not really. I always lose. I know. That's why it's fun. <laughs> How about license plates with prime numbers? How about we lose the bow tie? Why? Look around, honey. None of the other kids are wearing one. Well, perhaps we'll send a five. No, you won't. Please trust Mommy. All right, tell you what. You take it off, and this weekend... All right. This is your homeroom. Do you want me to go in with you? No. Although I could have used you in the restroom. Okay, well, you have a good day, and I'll pick you up after school, same door we came now. Are you crying or having I'm sure you're well aware we have a student with us who, despite his young age, is remarkably gifted. And I expect y'all to make him feel welcome. Yes, Sheldon? Part of the student dressing room and This is me of being in breach of the hygiene code. Well, Heber, it wouldn't kill you to shower a little more often. George, you want to weigh in here? Well, Oral Roberts University is a wonderful school. He said I was intimidated by his intelligence, and then he offered to be my leader. Do you know this sonata? No. How long have you played the piano? I don't play piano. George, you got any thoughts here? I certainly do. You have perfect pitch. Okay. Sweetheart, you should... Don't! Don't! Stop! 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 Stop. Stop. What's wrong with you? <laughs> you okay? No, I'm not okay. I know it's hard. But I'm telling you, is your coach? Quit your whining, get your uniform on, and you get your ass back out there. But what about my dad? Your dad's having a bad day. Listen. Hey, you were about to power a clock with a potato. Not possible. Now, listen. Am I in trouble? No. Maybe. Just listen. You're not going to make it in this, Sheldon. And I got a bad reputation. Oh, that's why you drink so much beer. Just do yourself a favor, okay? Go to school tomorrow and mind. That was the first time I held my father's hand. Amen.